Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Nest.js. Today we are going to learn how to read an uploaded CSV file using Nest.js and the Malta. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. So let's get started. First of all, if you haven't seen my previous videos, then you have to look out my previous video for how to, about the Malta. Okay, so I will let you know about exactly what extensions we have to install or the packages. Give me a second. So this is the file uploaded code for before one. Okay, so this is we have to for the Malta, we have to use the Malta platform express. Then here, one more thing we have to add that is CSV parser. Okay, so these modules you have to install. Okay, after this, we have to go with our file module.ts where we have to do the file multi configuration so here we in the imports multi module register destination that should be uploads controller that is file up controllers right so first we have to create the file module.ts in the source directory and here we have done the where we have to upload the files okay that is we have to upload the csv file then we have to read right so first upload code over here so upload the csv file Okay, then we have to go with the files controller where we have add the logic. Okay, so here we have the interceptors upload file in the next JS common. This is basically the decorator for uploading the files. Okay, so here I'm using the CSV parser for parsing the CSV. So whatever data we have in that we have to look into it. Okay, so this is, this is the files and the upload. So file slash upload. This is our REST API path. Okay. Then if the file if there is no file, then there should be a no file uploaded. Else, what we are going to do is we are going to make a result array should be empty, and then we are going to read the file. After reading the file, whatever data we are getting, then we can parse the data. We can just print the data over here. Here you can perform the operations on the parse CSV, for example, save it to the database or perform some data processing. You can do that part over here okay so first we check that whatever data we have uploaded we have successfully passed or not right so create read stream read the uploaded file as a stream and pass it as a csv right so let's see the data is parsed or not and the last what we have to do if you want to unlink the uploaded file then you can use fs unlink the file path okay you can also do that at the last file upload is processed and upload it successfully right and the last app module.ts where we have to import the file module file module imports file module okay these three files required let's try to upload the csv file and check how we can parse the csv data right so let's go to the postman this is our route files upload so let's parse any csv file so i have already file that is in the home Okay, I think they don't have the permissions. Okay, so I need to put, let me upload the files. So here in the, which location is, is in the recent documents. Okay, let me add this in the document. So here we have a data.csv and let's move into the documents. Okay, so let me paste this over here, data.csv. Let's try to upload that one. Okay. So here we have the documents. Here we have a data.csv. Let's try to upload this file. And we have to check that one. It is uploaded in the data.csv or not. Send it. File uploaded. Let's check in the upload section of the HTML where we have a nest project. File upload app. And here we have the upload section. And here you can see that the CSV file is uploaded. Right? So let's check it out whether the files we have passed the data or not so here you can see that name john email age name john email so all the three records have been fed successfully i will open that csv file so here this is a csv file okay the name email and the age john dot jane smith and alice right so this is successfully we have uploaded and successfully passed the data right any doubt, any query in that, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.